Welcome to the North Branch Conservation Area. Of course, part of the McHenry County Conservation District. And this park is a little special because we will start out here, take this one and a half mile trail, connect up with the Prairie Trail or Fox River Trail, whatever you want to call it. And we can walk into Wisconsin. And that's what we're going to do. This is the ground we got to cover, even in this cold weather. And when they say North Branch, they're not kidding. Here's our map of McHenry County. I've shown this map a few times now. You're all the way up here. The only thing that's closer than that to the border pretty much is this Elizabeth Lake Nature Preserve, which we'll definitely got to do that sometime as well. But today, we are here. All right, here we go. Now I'm gonna make this walk as quick and brief as possible because it is freezing. We also kind of lost our sun. <laughs> the main purpose today is to head over the border. I kind of forgot how quickly it gets dark <laughs> this time of year, so we have a little change of plans. We're going to get to the bridge, which is really the only point of interest here on this trail. And now we're going to backtrack, get out of the lot before we get locked, and then we're going to head over to the Wisconsin side and cross this border. All right, let's get back to the car. Get out of this wind for a few minutes anyway. Ah, we're back in the car. They said today was supposed to be colder than yesterday when we did the Long Meadow Parkway Trail. I'm starting to believe them. But I am gonna see that border one way or the other. So let's head into Wisconsin. And just to show you how close we are to the border, we have just pulled out of the preserve and we have our sign to Genoa City. And this is the end of Illinois. Welcome to Genoa City, Wisconsin. So to get to the northern end of the Prairie Trail, we have to go to Main Street here. Get to their little downtown area.
Now their downtown continues this way. That's how we get to County Highway 8. But we want to keep going straight. It's that little grocery store is over there. But we are going to continue going straight on Main Street. All the way to Grove Street. And we do have a sign for a bike route, so that's cool. We are going to make a right. And take this street until it ends. actually on southeastern court now and here we go this is what we want right here and this is it this is the northern end the start of the prairie trail The one that runs south along the Fast River, all the way down to Aurora and beyond, that connects up with the Prairie Path, heads east out to my hometown in Elmhurst. It all starts here. And we are technically in Wisconsin right now. This is so cool. I've been wanting to walk this for so long. We're finally doing it. They have a cute little park here. This is called Anders Park. A Genoa City Park. But I just saw something that really <laughs> caught my interest. Now, I really wasn't planning to visit this park, but I saw something that was a definite geek out moment for me, if no one else. A McHenry County Conservation District boundary sign. Yeah, McHenry County, Illinois. And this is Genoa City, Wisconsin. So yeah, we have ourselves a little state border thing. Does anyone find that cool besides me? A McHenry County, Illinois conservation sign in Genoa City, Wisconsin. I think it's cool. So far this is even cooler than a nature preserve. Leave it to me to spot that sign from a distance. Alright folks, this might not end well, but let's go. Ugh. Not too bad. Alright, continuing on.
Now my original plan was to walk to this point from North Branch Conservation Area, but yeah, I decided not to do that. <laughs> With these trees here, it should be a little bit more pleasant of a walk and should actually not be too far down here. And if I continued to walk down this trail, we would indeed eventually run into McHenry. And this is indeed the site of the old Chicago Northwestern Railway. The one that goes from Chicago through Arlington Heights into Crystal Lake and up north, eventually leading into Wisconsin. Now at this point, we are definitely in Illinois. So we're going to backtrack and see if I missed something, but we may not actually have any border markers to my disappointment. But we do have some power lines there, which is definitely an indication of a train line in the past. So yeah, basically the train line now ends in Ringwood, but used to come all the way up this way. All right, we are very close to the border line now the best I could tell from Google Maps, and I found this little path here, which is kind of interesting. You know how, like, Canada and the USA always have a little tree clearing on their border? Kind of reminds me of that. Don't know if it's actually anything significant or not. Basically leads to a cornfield. I think this is the border, though. It's a little bit more wooded to the left, which would be the North Branch Conservation Area. And where it's a little bit more open there would be Genoa City and that park. And I know I am very close, but that's really all I have to go by. There is no markers on the ground anywhere. A little surprised. But we do have that McHenry County Conservation Boundary sign, so we will use that as a border. So there's the park. And yeah, I would say where we were is definitely going to be the border. Only wish there was some kind of marker, but that would be about it. But we do have our little sign over there. <laughs> and the sun is starting to set on the border. But since we're here, let's check this out anyway. Here's our boundary line. There you go. And the sun adds a extra special effect on this shot. And we can peek down at where the border officially crosses the trail. So if you want an easy way to ride your bike in Wisconsin, this is one of the ways. And it only seems appropriate to end our vlog today at the Genoa City Travel Center. Wow, that's interesting. Maybe more than just clothes for the night.
even the ice cream place then is closed. Ooh, that looks good. <laughs> Well, I hope you enjoyed my kind of random adventure from both Richmond, Illinois, and Genoa City, Wisconsin. It was a little chilly, but I had fun. Click the like button if you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram. Thank you for watching. And just like that, Full circle, we are back in Richmond, Illinois.